Hello everybody, it is Kosafir again, and welcome to the episode 2 of my single player gameplay. So, the last episode you saw me do the Goblin Diplomacy quest. Uh, this time I was going to do Vampire Slayer, but I didn't want to show like two quests in two episodes straight away. So, um, I'm going to be doing some skilling, you know, um, sort of like upgrading my gear and, well, hopefully upgrading my gear. And maybe a little bit of combat. So for those who don't know, I am a fighter who uses a two-handed sword. Um, at the moment I have a steel plate body, as you can see. I've got an iron two-hander and an iron four helmet. Um, since last episode, I did um, Pirate's Treasure and Ernest a Chicken, so if I show you my inventory. I got the gold ring from treasure, uh, pirate's treasure, and um, I had an emerald but I sold it, <laughs> and um, I got some, I think it was about 700 GP from um, Ernest the Chicken, and I am level 6. I'm not quite sure what level I was last time, but I think I got a few levels since. Um, I'm actually really, really close for my next level. I think it's like... Um, one more level to go. I mean, not one more level. Um, one K XP to my next level, or about eight hundred uh, XP. So hopefully, I can get that level in this episode. Um, so wait for this to load. I am going to Faldor because um, this module here, my um campaign. I think I have the updated one. I don't think I do. Mm, no, I. No, I do not have the updated one. Um, at the moment, I am building RD itself, like the outskirts for the uh, North Canterin. Um I lost Ardoing. Uh, if you remember, well, if anybody remembers, um, I did a Ardoing um, city tour um, quite a while ago. I think it was maybe um, over six months, I believe. Um, but I was doing that tour. And I lost that. <laughs> um, I uh, it's so annoying, and I I pretty much lost the file for Ardy, so um, I have to remake it. So yeah, I'm getting pretty tired of rebuilding Ardy all over again. <laughs> so I'm just gonna at the moment. Um, I am in the Dwarven mine, and I'm just gonna mine some iron and coal. I believe he was, uh, is there an item I choose this week? No, not yet. Um, onto that topic, um, we just said. Um, it can be annoying when, so sort of like, uh, because, let me show you the inventory, you have like fr uh, four inventory slots. That's 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32. So you got 32 items, uh, or 32 slots on each of the bank. And you got four of them, so that's like over like 114 or something. And obviously, you don't want to be carrying like 140 food around with you. So what I did was I added weight onto the items. Um, a lot of items, I'd say. So if I show you this coal, um, it weighs five pounds. Um, if I show you this mithril plate, it weighs 50 pounds. So you can't carry like a crap ton of stuff. So you can only carry about 30 items. So it's like similar to RuneScape. So I got two coal and one iron, so that's a one steel bar I could try and make. Yay, success. Just one steel bar, um I wanna make a I wanna make I need a steel sword in a steel helmet, but uh, my smithing is quite low. So I need twenty smithing to smith steel. And as you can see I just barely reached that one. Um, so I bought, well I had 10k gold and I bought a ton of iron ore. So as you can see iron ore is 279 and I was making mithril maces out of them which are, I could sell mithril maces for like 300 gold. So I was making like 20 gold per um, iron ore I bought but sometimes I did fail so like I lost a little bit of profit but still I think I made like 1k profit 
So now I have um, 14k gold or close to it. So that's two, four, six. Okay, so two more. And oh yeah, so as you can see, I've just been um, overweight and I'm starting to walk really slow. So I got two, two, four, six. Oh god, two, four, six, eight. So that's um, four steel bars. Um, hopefully I can smith yeah. a lot of them. Yeah. And I need to turn yeah. up my volume. Not our uh, uh, my volume, yeah. my freaking um, voice. Because once you use an item, your character makes some stupid noise for the rest of the game. Um, I'm not quite sure how that bug is, sort of like, how it came to be, but it is annoying. So I got, um, I got five steel bars. Um, I don't want to risk a two-hander just yet, so I'm going to be safe and make a steel med helmet. Not med, um, steel wall, so it's only <sighs> fail. What is it? Um, so I need 22. Mm, so it's like a 40% chance of smithing. Ah, oh, god damn it. Failed. Um, I'm close to a level, so I'm gonna get my smithing up. Eight, two more, one more. Ooh, I am now level seven. Uh, let's see. So I wanna put it in smithing, because I can. Uh, yeah, I'll do smithing. So what's my smithing now? 14. Right, so I've got to be close to be able to sort of like fully smith. <laughs> I went to do, well I went to train on cockroach workers and my first drop was a mithril plate. And I believe a mithril plate is rare on, um, on a cockroach worker. And I was just happy because of that. So I don't have to sort of like try and smith my own, um, my own mithril plate or try save up for gold to buy one. Success. Um, really I've only got three. Um, right, let's try this again. Um, steel, two-hander, get lucky, three, two, one. Yes! Success! Sweet. I have a brand new sword, so let's, um, I stand in the light, let's go by the obelisk, because that's probably the lightest spot in here. Uh, Alright, so there is my iron two-hander, and I'm going to get rid of that. Uh, um, so let's put this on and see the difference. Well, that looks, that suits a lot more with my armor. Ah, oh, that looks good. Let's um, compare the stats, so... <laughs> I can't even click. So, 7 damage in slashing and 1 and enchantment bonus. I'll explain that in a second. So that's 7 and 1. So now it's 14 and 2. So pretty much just doubled my attack damage. Sweet. And it, lo it looks really nice. It's really um, jagged as well. Let's go. Steal. Please do not fail. Yes, success. Um, right, let's find an anvil. Um, I'm not too fussed if this fails, but still would be nice. Yay, success, sweet. So I got a helmet and a sword. Although it's only a steel med. Uh, let's check the stats on it first. So I get 5 HP, so that's not changed, but I get resistance in 5 bludgeoning, which is sort of like crush. So if a monster deals 20 damage um, with crush or bludgeoning, on me, it will take five. It will take five of that damage off. So, if he hits twenty, he will hit only five. Okay. Let me get that straight. Um, if he hits twenty, he will only hit um, fifteen. There we go. Please, I'm getting tongue twisted then. Um, so that's my iron four helmet. That's my steel med helmet. I forgot what it was then. Uh, that looks alright. Uh, it's just a shinier version of the um, Iron Med Helmet. But yeah, um, I'm going to save my helmet and I'm going to save my sword. Um, these probably sell for like 500 gold each. But geez, all this cost me 10k gold. Um, I don't think I'll ever go by my um, ore from there again.